imagine a space without time, an existence that no science, arithmetic, or religion will ever be able to explain. Dive deep into the depths of your own being while soaring to the outer reaches of the universe. Imagine a single man, so big in his own mind that he has to do his own introduction. The Earth has aligned with the Sun. It's time for the Brian Cusco live stream. Hello! Top of the morning or top of the evening, friends and family. Oh, it's time for the live stream. I didn't think it was ever going to happen. I felt like I was about to fall asleep instead of doing the live stream. But it's a good thing I woke up because it's time to do the live stream. Thank you guys for being here tonight. I appreciate you guys being in the chat. Amy Brunner, Clicia Robertson, um, Julieta Ramirez, of course, the Kirkman, Scottish Rob, uh, Golems and Demons. We had a whole bunch of people in the chat. I'm not reading off anything. I'm going from memory here. Who else is in here? Mr. Jeremy Turgeon, Brassman Reptiles. This is an important one. Um, at some point, I think I just might change that intro, but for now, it's, it's fun. It's fun. I took out the naked part. I don't know why. I should put the naked part back in. I don't know why. Why did I take out the naked part? Nobody knows. We're talking about U.S. Arc tonight, and, uh, we, so for that reason, I would appreciate you guys sharing this live stream or sharing this post after the fact, because we're going to be sharing some very important information. Um, a lot of times when I do videos about U.S. Arc or, or when some people start talking about U.S. Arc, a lot of people seem to run and hide, and I'm talking about people that keep reptiles, which... That is what you're going to have to do if U.S. Arc is not successful in what they're doing. You're going to have to run and hide because it's not going to be legal to have the animals that you have if everybody that U.S. Arc is fighting against succeeds. So, share it and we'll, we'll go over it. And we'll, we'll, uh, what is on my cup? What is that? I mean, besides, besides that. So, so this, this. This is what this is what USR is going for, and loud noises. <laughs> loud no <laughs> loud noises attract flies and fuzz. Man, that was that was whack. Okay, here we go. You guys ready? Let's let's take a look at this. I'm gonna make it real simple. We're gonna get, we're gonna jump right in. You guys ready? We're just gonna, we're just gonna dive right in. So yesterday was the last day to leave comments for the North Carolina thing. So hopefully you guys did that. We talked about that before on a previous stream. So hopefully you guys got the memo there, especially North Carolina folks. It was very important. So hopefully if you're in North Carolina, you did get your comments. And what I'm going to do right now is get your comments about US ARC um, filtered in the right direction, just in case you didn't know, to make it real easy. So I'm just going to pull up... Um, this screen right here, and we'll we'll make it easy. I, I made sure that I could do this without thinking too hard, because everybody knows that thinking for me is a real challenge, and um, it's not always something that we want to watch me do. So, okay, screen. There we go. This is the homepage of US Arc. All you got to do, and the links in the description. You just got to go to US Arc. That's U S A R K dot org you go there you'll find this beautiful page with the new new logo by mr blake stewart and you'll see their mission statement and all that other stuff and if you don't have any money whatsoever you're completely broke and somehow still keeping reptiles i don't know how you do that but um you can come here and you can sign up for the newsletters that you know what's happening and i imagine a good amount of the folks here on this stream know about this but that's why i'm asking you to share it with people who might not know um so here's all you got to do we got a new thing coming up you guys remember the lacy act and and how us arc won the federal uh they, they filed a federal lawsuit against the government and won. That was back in like 2015, I think, 2016. That was right when I was just moving from Hawaii and diving into it and met Phil and, and learned about U.S. Arc and all that stuff. And, and they won. it was an unprecedented event for the uh, reptile, for the pet industry as a whole. Unprecedented event, like for, the, for a small group like U.S. Arc to win the lawsuit against the entire U.S. federal government. But... With a bill that's coming up soon, they're incorporating some little things into some language. So let's let's go over what that is right now. Let's bring the screen back up, and let's take a look. So if you go, and it's the first thing they just updated it today, as you see. Um, 
it's the competes act and it's what is it, hr5 hr4521 and so let's read in here kind of what would happen we'll just we'll just read through it if you guys don't mind we will read what phil wrote here i imagine this is what phil wrote it seems like phil's writing the america competes act which is an acronym passed out of the rules committee as expected it will next go to the full house for a vote. Our goal is not to stop the bill, but to get the Lacey Act amendments removed before it goes to the Senate. During today's hearing, Arkansas Representative Rick Crawford specifically cited the Lacey Act amendments as provisions that, quote, would not stand a chance if they were vetted through regular order and the legislative process. The hearing was filled with opposition and pointed concern that this act was far too broad and unfocused with an unreasonable number of amendments, over 600, I guess. The act strays far beyond its stated purpose. Keep contacting your representatives. And there's a link. Uh, buried within the almost 3,000 pages of the America Competes Act, like Lacey Act amendments that affect all non-domesticated pet animal. That's basically anything except for cats, dogs, and traditional farm animals. Uh, it affects... All, all those kind type of animal animal keepers and owners. Um, Competes is an acronym for creating opportunities for manufacturing preeminence in technology and economic strength. Man, who came up with that? The stated purpose of the act is to strengthen America's economic and national security, but obviously this was slipped into the massive bill in hopes to go unnoticed. Isn't it fun how they do that? And this is why we need USR to keep on top of these things right here. So... I'm just going to scroll down to the important part for you. So obviously, obviously, you know that we don't want this to slip through as they're trying to do. So we don't want that to happen. How did I make that disappear and reappear? Okay. We want that to, we don't, we, we want to help US Arc get what they need. And it's super simple. I've already, in fact, in the amount of time this live stream's been going, you could have already done what you need to do to help, which is super simple. And I'm going to tell you exactly how simple it is right here. You just go to the link, right down here, they got a list for you right here, one, two, three, four. Call your representatives and the rules committee at the phone number they've got, or email at the link below, or fax letters, and share this to encourage others to complete the alert. Find your U.S. representative, they give you a nice link right here, you just click on that and you can find them, it's pretty simple, you just go in, you enter your zip code, and then they'll get your representative, and with a quick little press of a button, you'll be able to send them an email, so... And when you go to the see, this is how easy that they make it for you. They give you a subject line to put in your email, and they give you a whole sample letter right here that gives you a pretty good outline of what you should say and sincerely your name. Now, obviously, you want to copy and paste this, and then you know, make some make some artistic adjustments. Um, you know, I implore you to remove the lace tag, like maybe put your name and and. You know, you don't have to get, you don't have to be an English major. That's how easy they make it for you. Like, I, I'm horrible at writing letters like this, or at least I think I am. And so with this outline, all you got to do is go in and maybe change a few things, maybe leave out something that doesn't seem as important. But they literally give you this that you can just bam, 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 copy and paste. Just grab it all, copy it, plug in your email, make a couple changes to make it a little more personal to you, and then send it off to your representative. It's, that's super easy. If you're not comfortable with making a phone call, which I'm sure lots of people aren't, it's so simple to send this email. And the more you hear from, the more they hear from us, the more we're helping out USR to accomplish this. So that's, that is what it is. Um, I, I don't think it could be made any more simple. It's right there. The link, I should you just go to usr.org. Just click on the section that I showed you. Click on the link, find your representative, send off the email. It literally, I mean, you could just copy and paste that email. Uh, if you don't have the time to type in a couple extra sentences or, or, or customize it just a little bit to yourself, it's super easy, super, super easy. And I mean, that's, that's it, dude. That's it. We, we don't want this thing to pass. It's, it's going to be a constant battle. I don't think that in our lifetimes we'll see a time when we don't need to have U.S. Arc and we don't need to push for this just because the nature of legislation, they're just there to keep their jobs and by keeping their jobs, they need to make more laws and introduce new laws constantly. So this is going to be a battle that we're going to be fighting for a long time. And hopefully we'll keep on the winning side of it. Ah, yes. Um, I appreciate the super chats. Sorry, I, yeah, I, I didn't uh, 
I was on the other screen, so you guys, things didn't pop up on the screen, but Golems and Demons, U.S. Ark, Stomp the Lacey Act, and Amy Brunner appreciates us spreading the word. Well, we will keep on spreading the word as long as we need to. Anytime something like this comes up, and just, you know, try and be a reminder, and try and remind folks as often as we can, or whatever it seems important. Well, it's always important, but whenever something comes up, and just, you know, throw those reminders out there, just in case people forget what it is that's happening, and what it is that we need to be doing on our end to help. Super simple. Super simple. Not hard. So easy. Um... And that's that's roughly it for me, I think. I don't think that I have anything else to bring to this live stream. I guess we could uh, I don't know. If you guys have you guys have any ideas down below, let me know what you what you need from me right now. I'll I'll help out however I can as far as uh, keeping this stream entertaining <laughs> now that I'm done with my main message and that has been spread. I, I don't know if you need me to repeat it, but I think it's pretty. If you can just watch this stream over, go back and, and listen to what I just said, and click on the links. Click on the link that's in the description to get you where you need to go. And I think that's it. I'm tired. I had a headache, but you know th this was an important one, so I, I just I didn't want to miss it and make it happen. So uh, feed an animal, says Sasquatch. <laughs> You know what, Leia would probably love to come in here and feed our, um, you know, the other day she was feeding our African bullfrog mealworms, and she was absolutely loving it. Uh, Julieta Ramirez, a question about a Brazilian rainbow boa. Um, go ahead and, and ask away. I definitely am not the authority on rainbow boas whatsoever. Oh, oh, that's, that's something I forgot to bring up. We are, however, having uh, Miss... Uh, where is it? Miss Megan Kelly, Megaconda, is going to be on the stream this evening. Not this stream, but our, our Patreon stream that we always do, our Zoom call, um, in about 15 minutes. And we'll be talking about the Triple B TV episode that went up today. And we did talk about Rainbow Boas there, just for a brief moment, and, and kind of how they relate to anacondas. I just kind of noticed it right there, but... Um, Am I going to the Tinley Park show in March? Actually, I just booked my flights yesterday. So, yep, I'm definitely going to Tinley Park. I'm still riding the fence on Arlington. I really want to go. Tickets are super expensive. Need to take the kids to Disneyland. Both kids, because they have the same birthday. Both older and oldest and youngest. Uh, next month as well. So, need to make sure that happens. So, I'm, I'm just figuring it out and see if it works. But, um... If this thing does pass, then yes, uh, U.S. Arc will likely go to court and bring another lawsuit like they have previously, but that is just going to be long. Hopefully we can get it knocked out before it even gets to that point. So, yeah. Um, yeah, no, headache is mostly mostly tamed down. It was just from not eating all day long, um, just getting work done, no time to eat until later which was you know my mistake i should have eaten a couple hours sooner but sometimes you just got you get in a groove you're going you don't want to stop to make yourself some food for a couple minutes so that's that's what happens it's all right i'm fine i'm totally fine um yes 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 jeremy jeremy has the answers Jer jeremy is uh, always st steadfast and keeping up with us arc and making sure that he spread. He, Jeremy does a very good job of spreading the word U.S. Arc too. I mean, there's a lot. There's great. There's plenty of folks out there who do a great job. There's so many of us. It's great. The more we do it, the more people keep doing it, and the more you do, click on that link and send those emails so that our voice is heard in the government, so they know that we're out here and that we care. And I mean, we're part of this country, right? The the government is supposed to do our bidding, right? That's that's what that's how it's set. That's how it's supposed to be. They're not here to tell us what to do. We're here to tell them how to do it for us, right? That's really that's really what's supposed to happen. This isn't something like, oh, can you please do this for me? It's you do this for me. That's your job. We just need to let them know what it is we need them to do. If we don't let them know, they don't know, and they'll just do what somebody else tells them to do because that, that is also a citizen of this country, and we go from there. Yeah, relationships. Good ones, you know? Good relationships. The, 
I, I have nothing else to say about it. <laughs> Um, Harsh Reptiles, Junior and Halo are actually together right now. Uh, I have not witnessed a lock between the two. However, okay, so if you guys are watching, Junior and Halo are our reticulated pythons that we decided to pair this year. And, um, nope, no, no locks have I witnessed, but there's definitely been some activity. Just because I didn't witness one doesn't mean they haven't. So they're together at, as we speak, based on the way Halo is moving at the moment. I don't think they're probably locked at this moment, but, you know, they may have been. Uh, can we see the puppy? Yeah, that's that's probably something we could uh, we could probably do something like that. Let's let's do that. We got a few minutes left in this stream. We'll we'll bring down the puppy. Puppy is not so much puppy anymore. Uh, I mean, he's still a puppy for sure. He still acts like a puppy. He went to the beach for the first time this weekend, which was awesome because he he hadn't been to the beach yet, you know, because waiting on Parvo shots and all that. But um, um, status uh, Aurora status of the wellness contest is that it's going, um, it's over. The, the time to join has ended. And I think that basically we will wait until this clutch hatch is over here. And once that clutch starts to hatch, we'll do a little video and we'll, we'll show which ones come out and then we'll, you know, do a drawing of the, of the winners. I've, Hillary's got a whole list of everybody and, and at what level they joined in at and all that stuff. Um, so, yeah, that'll be coming up pretty quick here because that clutch is supposed to hatch like this weekend or this week. It's really dimpling in very heavily and should be should be going pretty quick. I'm supposed to be calling right now to see about the puppy for you guys. I'm doing it. I'm doing it right now. I'm calling. Now let's see what other questions we got. Big puppy. Uh, no. Yeah, yeah, right. It's Reagan Rainy Railroad Pipe. Hello. Can we uh can we have we have we have a puppy request down here? Okay, thanks. You can just have... Okay, thanks. All right. Puppy is coming. Um, great, great. You guys have plenty of questions tonight. That's perfect. Um, yeah, yeah. Reagan, 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 Yeah. Novel idea, right? Sometimes we need reminding. Sometimes we just need reminding that the government is there to do our bidding. That's what they're there for. I know it seems like it's not the case much of the time, but maybe we just didn't let them know enough. They, they, they are here to bend to our will and support our our wishes that's what we pay them for right it's true um okay uh people didn't or the legals didn't get out. i'm not sure i'm not sure what you're saying um i'm, I'm okay Cayucas dog no it's actually a uh, moral bay i guess it's technically maybe it is technically Cayucas at that point is what you get because it is like very very north moral bay and like once you pass the last thing so it might be technically Cayucas at that point <laughs> Come here, Bob. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> this guy in his... Come here, you little Bob. Come on, come on, little Bob. Little Bob, Bob, Bob. Oh, yeah, that's all. Look at him. He's huge. And he's beautiful. He had a nice... He had a b nice bath right after the beach. Huh. Are you so fresh and clean right now? Are you the cleanest puppy in the world? Are you so fresh? Are you so nice? Oh, you smell amazing. Oh, you smell like wonderful biscuits. You just had some steak. Oh, you just had some steak? You had steak? And I'm just down here drinking whiskey doing a live stream? I want some steak! Mm, Papa. Oh. This is Hilo, if you didn't know. Hilo, the puppy. Fresh, clean, gonna go on a road trip with all the cousins. Up to see great great grandma! <laughs> it's gonna be so much fun! Oh, that good poor boy. That's a good poor boy. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, are you ready to go back and get more steak? Me too. All right. You go get steak. I'll join you up there for some steak in just a little bit. Come on, buddy. All right, pup. Come you on. go, boy. Come on, this Let's go. 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 let us She's shedding like a crazy biscuit right now. Heli is going to love this. Um, yes, but I'm going to go get prepared for our Zoom call with Mrs. Kelly. Miss Kelly. And you guys, uh, I mean, you take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. Please go send those emails. So simple. So easy. Literally two minutes. That's all it would take. Two minutes. Two and a half. Three tops. That's it. That's all. Um, 
And oh, he said, get the indigo out. Okay, okay, last thing. I'll get the indigo out. One second, please. It's not food time. Yeah, you know, I'm a sucker for an indigo snake. All right, there she is. This is Midnight, for those of you that don't know. The female Eastern Indigo Snake, Dry Marcon Cooperi. There she goes. She's a beauty. Let's see if we can just focus on the snake. Oh, there we go. Man, that's a good looking snake. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. What an amazing animal. So cool, so intelligent. I would love to produce some of these some point, someday. Look at that. That is just freaking perfection. Oh, wow. Oh, it never gets old, dude. Never gets old. So cool. Oh, man. Amazing. All right. All right. I'm out. You guys take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. Thank you for watching the stream. Please support USR. Please go send those emails. Very, very important. Send them right now. Unless you're joining us for the Zoom call, in which case, no, you have time. We're not starting the Zoom call for seven minutes. Go send those emails real quick, and we'll see you back on uh, the link in the description for the Patreon Zoom call you want to join. Come join us. All right? You guys, take care of yourselves. Aloha. Thank you for watching the live stream. I really had a lot of fun. If you want to see more live stream, tune in next week for that one. If you tune in for this live stream, I hope you want some real cool stuff. I'd love to do more live stream, but I think you had enough.